Looks like we got here before the Klingons, Captain. We should make the most of this advantage. What are your orders? I've managed to establish comms with the colony. It's not a great signal, but it's the best we're gonna get. Putting him through now. Hello, Captain. What can I do for you? Run that by me again. Your signal's breaking up. Did you say Klingons? What about them? We just lost contact with Corvan 2, Captain. Something's blocking all subspace signals in this area. There's a comm satellite nearby. It should boost our signal so we can warn the ships and the colony. The SAT uses our security protocols. We should be able to access it. Our hails are still blocked. The Klingons may be attempting to isolate the planet before they land. Orders, Captain? Not from orbit, Captain. The Klingons are disrupting transporter operations at the local level. Colonial evacuations on a mass scale can be... problematic. We may have to try to hold the Klingons here until Starfleet reinforcements arrive. Klingon forces inbound on an attack vector, Captain! short-range comms again. Long-range signals are still blocked. I've updated the colony. However, the Klingons have started to send down attack squads. What are your orders? Captain! Trying to fight the Klingon landing craft. I 
think I can break through the Klingon jamming and hail the civilians. for long. I'm reading more enemy ships on long-range sensors as well. It won't be long before the colony is overrun. I recommend we beam down to help the miners while we can. This isn't good. According to our readings, over half the colony has been overrun by the Klingons. At the rate they're moving, this area will fall in less than an hour. Right. Lead the way, Captain. I've got you. Lay the gate closed! We have to get out of here! others to die? We have to help them! Starfleet's here! Oh, thank goodness. Thanks. We didn't think anyone got our distress signal. But that's not true. We were about to surrender. We didn't have any weapons. We do have some spare armor suits with you and your officers. They're in the crates next to the gate. This code will open the gate. Chief Smythe and some of the others are still in there. I know it's asking a lot, but if you can, please, save them. Here are the codes to the gate. You have to save the Chief and the others.
careful. There's a lot of Klingons down there. Captain, no sign of Zabrova or Ticonderoga. I'm glad you're here, but so I'm sure you can guess we're uh, all a little on edge. If it wasn't for Fletcher visiting family here, I'd have eaten a disruptor place by now. Not to be critical, but uh, where are the rest of them? Oh, that is 
That's not good. We're in big trouble. These Klingons mean business. They've locked us out of the mine. Probably down there robbing us blind while we speak. There's no way we can beam anyone down to stop them. And they probably killed all our security there by now. Glad to hear it. We're definitely gonna need that help. There's some gear in those crates. Use it. to have some really unpleasant... Let me your communicator. If you're in Right. Here they come. Let them have it! Okay. I need you to pull the activator, invert it, and jam it back in. Trust me. Okay. It's in there. I think I got it. this as fast as I can. I'm a miner, not an engineer.
just have to knock. <laughs> what? The bombing has stopped. Something's wrong. Secure the dilithium and prepare it for immediate transport. No! Not so fast, Klingon! We're done here! Captain, the colony's security field is holding strong. There's still a lot of Klingon ships heading our way, though. We need to leave, and soon. But there's a problem. Civilian ships travel through here frequently. We need to warn them about the Klingons, or they could warp into the middle of a war zone. Absolutely. We could even remotely program the signal on a satellite as we leave the system, which we should, soon. <laughs> the message won't get very far, but anyone who enters the system will get the signal and be able to turn around before it's too late. Their attention, Captain. Oh, 
stood our ground at the Arucanus arm until the situation became untenable. After we disengaged, we were able to reach Starfleet and call for backup. Others will be arriving as soon as they can. We can't afford to lose this system to the Klingons. Don't mention it. You'd do the same were our situations reversed. I believe Captain Schaefer would be proud of you and your crew, Captain. Your efforts to defend the Federation are commendable, and my report will indicate this. Apart from your valor in combat, I'm particularly impressed by your work with the local satellites. Turning them into distant warning beacons was quite clever. Those signals will save a lot of lives. Indeed. I'm sure Starfleet Command has detailed plans for defending Corvan. For now, however, your work here is done. You're to report to the Soul System with the civilians you've rescued. Once you arrive, report to Admiral Kensington for debriefing. Fletcher would make a fine addition to your senior staff. I'll make a note of it in my report to Starfleet Command. You've done well under extraordinary circumstances. Anton's ship is in good hands. Keep up. We've done all we can. Congratulations. Let's get to safety while we still can. After everything we went through out there, going back to Professor Shermer's advanced physics class doesn't seem as scary now. I mean, what's string theory compared to dodging Klingon disruptor blasts or trying to keep a warp core stable? Speaking of scary, think Admiral Kensington's gonna go easy on you? The ship did kind of get beat up. A little. Uh, okay, a lot. The Admiral's office is this way. Thanks for coming. You've been through a lot. Starfleet Command appreciates your efforts, especially at the Corvin system. I do as well. I've read the official reports, but I'd like to hear your take on it all. In hmm, this Jaula has become quite a thorn in our side. You're fortunate. Very few have survived combat with her. Our agents are on the hunt for Ju'ula as we speak. Bringing in the sister of Takuthma will be quite a blow to Klingon morale. Rest assured, you're not the only one who wants her to pay for her crimes. Neither do I, unfortunately. Well then, based on what I'm seeing here, you're exactly the kind of officer Starfleet needs now. I know your ship might not be the Enterprise, but you've proven yourself capable of sitting in her center chair. The job's yours if you want it. Yes, under normal circumstances, it would take years of work to get your own command. But these aren't normal circumstances. The war isn't going well for us. We don't have the luxury of waiting years before putting good officers on the line. We need them out there right now. We need you. Yes, Corvin would have been a dis... Thanks for coming. You've been through a lot. Starfleet Command appreciates your efforts, especially at the Corvin system. I do as well. I've read the official reports, but I'd like to hear your take on it all. Hmm, this Jaula has become quite a thorn in our side. You're fortunate. Very few have survived combat with her. Our agents are on the hunt for Ju'ula as we speak. Bringing in the sister of Takuthma will be quite a blow to Klingon morale. Rest assured, you're not the only one who wants her to pay for her crimes. Neither do I, unfortunately. Well then, based on what I'm seeing here, you're exactly the kind of officer Starfleet needs now. I know your ship might not be the Enterprise, but you've proven yourself capable of sitting in her center chair. The job's yours if you want it. Yes, under normal circumstances, it would take years of work to get your own command. 
But these aren't normal circumstances. The war isn't going well for us. We don't have the luxury of waiting years before putting good officers on the line. We need them out there right now. And yes, Corvin would have been a disaster if it weren't for you and your crew. Starfleet wants to recognize that. Therefore, as of now, I'm making your promotion and command official. I see the same things in you that Schaefer did. Honor his name and make us all proud. I wouldn't recommend it. I have it on good authority. I'm quite a terror when crossed. On to more mundane duties, hmm? You'll need to check in with the tailor and update your uniform in a manner appropriate to your new rank. After that, acquire a shuttle for your ship. When you're finished, return to me for new orders. You don't look unhappy. That's good, right? Your minimap shows you where your objectives are. An arrow will appear on the minimap if you are far away from your objective. This way. The shipyard officer is this way. Congratulations on your promotion. I will let you know when I have a new task for you. You survived! Then again, you survived fighting House Mokai. Admiral Kensington must have been a walk in the park for you. I guess this is goodbye. At least for now. You've got a ship and a crew to take care of, and I, well, I still have to graduate. Hey, do you think... They'll use your ship for the cadet cruise next year. If they do, put in a good word for me. Uh, ah, great. great. <laughs> hey, I liked being your chief engineer out there. It, uh, it would be an honor to do that again, Captain. Oh man, this is hard. Uh, stay safe, okay? This war won't last forever. And I hope we're both doing what Starfleet does best soon. Exploring the galaxy, strange new worlds, all that.